everyone. So today, Layla Jane is four days old. We've been at home now for two days from the hospital and we are getting ready to take her to her first pediatrician's appointment. Hey, baby girl. You ready to go see the doctor today? Go get your first checkup. So these first four days have been amazing. They've been absolutely wonderful. Uh, Brian and I, you know, are just kind of falling into these roles of being a mother and a father. And, you know, it's not easy. It's definitely a big transition. We're still trying to figure out, you know, what goes where, how we're going to do things, who does what, what's our schedule going to be like. But that all just takes time. And so right now we're just figuring that out and just enjoying it too. But for now, we just need to get this little girl to her first appointment. Okay, getting her weight again. Okay, okay. seven, two, all right, okay, go ahead. Seven pounds, two ounces. Mm -hmm. All right, okay, let's get you back and dressed again. You ready? There you go. Okay, just go ahead. So Layla Jane has dropped five ounces, but we know that's normal. They usually lose weight uh, during their first week out of the hospital. So it was really pretty funny. I made two mommy mistakes right before we left here. Uh, one is as I was changing her diaper, um, I had her in a cute little outfit that you saw earlier and I forgot to put the clean diaper right underneath her and she started peeing everywhere and it got all over her cute outfit so we had to change her quickly and unfortunately the only onesie I could find or that we had clean was too big for her so oh well. And then next we were getting ready to walk out and I realized I didn't have a diaper bag. I had no diapers for her or wipes or anything because this is you know the first time we've ever had to leave the house with her and I'm just not in the habit of packing a diaper bag or anything so luckily I remembered it and now I just need to get in the habit of always bringing that diaper bag with me everywhere but we got here we're good and now we're just waiting for the doctor to come check her out we are back from the pedi pediatrician's office and sorry we couldn't really film much while we were in there and um, they really don't like people filming and also I just had my hands um, full trying to keep Layla Jane still while she was getting examined but she passed with flying colors everything was great I had tons of questions I was asking the doctor um, I sure I looked like a typical first mom in there but one thing she did recommend was we get some vitamin D drops to put into her uh, formula so uh, she recommended mommy's bliss it's a vitamin D drop that you can get at Target so I'll be going there probably tomorrow to pick those up but for right now we're just um, at back at home and I had to change Layla Jane's outfit a third time today because again we got some formula on it so here she is just snoozing away. Are you tired from your big outing today? That was the first time you've gone out since coming home. You need to rest and get some sleep. And Zeke is down here. He's never too far. He's always protecting her. You're a good boy, Zeke. All right. Good night, hun. Big yawn. So now it's time to file her nails for the first time. First manicure by grandma. Oh, she's doing well. Oh, look at those. Oops. Get those nails filed because they're just getting too long already. Yeah. So I asked grandma for help because both Brian and I were a little too nervous to file her nails right now because they're so small. We don't want to hurt her. So I know eventually we'll have to get used to it, but right now grandma's taking on this job. <laughs> All right, Layla Jane is out to the world. <laughs> and so is her daddy. <laughs> oh my goodness, I look at that. This. Zeke, what do you think okay. of your sister? <laughs> you baby girl, you're just so tired. Hi, so since going to the pediatrician and uh, trimming her nails, this little girl. Hey, sweetie. Sound asleep. She is one week old. I can't believe it. She's already one week. And, you know, this has just been such a fun yet tiring and trying week too. I'm not gonna sugarcoat it. Um, there's been some moments we definitely did not get through the week without some scrapes and bruises. I actually broke my toe this week too. 
Um, but I want to trade it for anything. This has just been amazing and an amazing new chapter in our lives. So tonight we are celebrating her one week little birthday by grilling out. Brian got some steaks and some vegetables and potatoes and Zeke is out here with us. And we're just gonna celebrate having her with us for one week so far. So we also thought it would be fun to kind of talk about some of the best and the worst moments of the week. So for me, the best moments, um, there's a few. Besides her actually being born, um, I think some of the best moments were seeing Brian with her and just seeing a whole new side of Brian that I'd never even seen before. Just how he just coddles over her and just loves her so much. Right? Isn't that right, girl? Your daddy loves you so much. He sure does. Um, a few other things is I love the little sounds she makes. We call her kind of like the Tin Man because she sounds like she's all squeaky. Sometimes I call her a little bird or a mouse. Just these little baby sounds are so cute. I just love them. Some of the other things that I've loved are um, just having her like lay on me when she falls asleep and just holding her and squeezing her. It's just an amazing feeling. I love it. Now, some of the worst things about this week. Um, trying to figure out her eating schedule. I cannot figure out like how many ounces of formula she needs and she it just kind of depends on each feeding. So it's a little trying trying to get a schedule with her, but you know that comes with having a newborn, so to be expected. Um, another my other downside is the baby blues. It's a real thing and I totally have it. I find myself just crying randomly at times and it's really embarrassing, um, but you know, a lot of women go through it so I shouldn't be embarrassed by it. But one of the funniest moments was I was at the grocery store the other day and a song from The Greatest Showman came on at the speakers. And as you might remember, that was the movie Brian and I were watching when I started having contractions and going into labor. And for some reason that just set me off and I just started bawling in the middle of the produce section. So at least I can laugh about it now. But those are my highs and lows of this first week with our little baby girl. One more high-low that I forgot to mention is um, not really ever putting on makeup, doing my hair, or putting on nice clothes kind of a low because i feel like i should be but also kind of a high because you know you just realize there's more important things than always having your makeup perfect or your hair absolutely perfect and you just kind of go with the flow a little bit more and it's kind of nice to be able to just do that from now on i i like it and then when you get dressed up for a nice occasion it makes it more special but for right now, how I look, my makeup, my hair, not as important as making sure I'm taking care of this little one. All right, so I will ask Brian's highs and lows in just a little bit. We're gonna take a quick break because the food is ready and we're starving, so we are going to eat dinner really quickly. And Miss Layla Jane is gonna keep on snoozing. You're missing a good meal, Layla. This looks amazing. Steak with a coffee rubbed bacon asparagus and sweet potato. Good job, Brian. So now that we have finished our delicious meal, Brian, so tell me, what were your best moments this week? Let's start with best. Honestly, everything's been awesome and a lot of fun in ways that I could never even have imagined. Yeah. Um, but with that, I would say the best moments are us working as a family together to uh, take care of her and also watching you with her Aww. and then from there um, just learning her and having a little girl like that right there is a lot for me. It's awesome right? The, what about the worst? <laughs> she's been trying to learn all her cues and figure out what she wants and when she wants it and making sure that I can control it at all times when she starts crying yep. and screaming really loud especially at night when sleep is important so that would probably be it. Other than that, everything's been fine and I know we'll learn. Right. Just typical newborn stuff, huh? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right. Well, I agree. 
to end our one week birthday celebration, we are going to go for a family walk. So Brian and I and Zeke and Layla, we're all gonna go for a little stroll around the neighborhood. I think she's enjoying the walk. It's a beautiful night out, gorgeous sunset. Just nice to be outside. So we're gonna sign off now. It's been a wonderful, wonderful first week with our little girl, and we're super excited for the other weeks to come. So thank you so much for watching. Please make sure to subscribe, and we'll see you next time. Bye.